بسم الله والحمد لله والصلاه والسلام على رسول الله اما بعد السلام عليكم ورحمه الله وبركاته my dear brothers in Islam and welcome back to another episode most likely we'll wrap it up here for the patients today we're going to talk about the more categories about patients especially in the path of da'wa and we'll talk about the hurdles and the way to alleviate them So hopefully this will be a nice clincher and hopefully that will set you on the right path and start you up running inshallah. With that we can start on that da'wah and the mashaqqat in the path of the da'wah itself. Allah subhanahu wa jalla fi'ula talked about this in the Quran as you will see Allah subhanahu wa jalla fi'ula mentioned. Why? You know why? Because when you actually start the da'wah my dear brothers and sisters you're talking to people uh, in the things that they actually don't want to hear. You know, you're going against their own whims and desires. People by nature want to do all these fun things and have, uh, you know, uh, blah, 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 and blah, 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 and you can, don't imagine, <laughs> stay with me here. <laughs> because you're talking to them, says, you know, be good. Man, people just want to wanna have fun, want to, you know, do all that, you know, stuff where we talked about before. No, we didn't talk about it, but just pretend that we talked about it before. <laughs> Am I sounding like a father and mother here? Okay, just in case. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has talked about it in Nuh alayhi salam. 950 years, man. 950 years. Could you imagine? <clears throat> 950 years. All that good. And, and only a few people became Muslims, you know, became submitters of those of monotheism that believed in one God. So it's very difficult indeed. So Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala talked about it. So let's talk about it. In the verse, which actually when I talk about Nuh, Rabbi inni da'awtu qawmi layla wa nahara. فَلَمْ يَزُرْهُمْ دُعَاءِ إِلَّا فِرَارًا وَإِنِّي كُلَّمَا دَعَوْتُهُمْ Oh Allah, I've asked my people. When? لَيْلًا وَنَهَارًا Nights and day. سِرًّا وَجَهْرًا Everything. Publicly, secretly. And it, what it does? It actually takes them away from it. It's, it's a rebel. They're rebels. The people actually do not want to submit. They don't want to be called a slave. Could you imagine you ask them to submit to your Lord? And you give them the proofs and everything else, they don't want to do it. وَإِذَا قِيلَ لَهُ اتَّقِ اللَّهَ أَخَذَتْهُ الْعِزَّ بِالْإِثْمِ فَحَسْبُهُ جَهَنَّمْ وَلَا بِئِسَ الْمِهَادِ When you tell people, اتَّقِ اللَّهَ You know what? I don't fear God Almighty, I'm going to fear you. So it you know, increases their actually evil deeds. It's amazing. But of course, the hikmah of the of da'wah, of course, كِنْ كَانَ أَمْرُكَ بِالْمَعْرُوفِ وَنَهِيُكَ عَنْ مُنْكَرِ يَتَرَتَّبُ عَلَيْهِ مُنْكَرْ أَكْبَرْ مِنْهُ فَتَرْكُوا وَعُولَى Which means, if you're going to enjoin good and forbid evil, and if the consequences of you enjoining good forbidding evil is bigger or greater evil, leaving it is better. So you have to have also wisdom when it comes to a da'wah, as we'll talk about it, inshallah, of the acquiring knowledge and how to give the da'wah in another path, inshallah. So when Nuh alayhi salam was given da'wah for people for 950 years, night and day, secret, publicly, what they did is they covered their faces. They don't want to see him. They, just, they put their fingers in their ears, covered their faces, don't want to hear about it. Can you imagine? So it's very difficult indeed. And so we will learn to be patient. Well, if it's 950 years, it's not good enough for you, I don't know what to tell you. So inshallah, if you can live that long, may Allah help you inshallah. But we have some more. You know, even in this path of da'wah, akhi, you will have people, your enemies. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala even gave enemies the prophets and messengers. We're not better than prophets and messengers, so rest assured you will have enemies. They will actually want to stop this path of Allah. And you want it, they want it crooked. Who else? Who's going to sell alcohol? Who's going to sell porn? Who's going to do drugs? You know, how are we going to go to nightclubs? Who's going to do gambling? Who's going to stop buying all this stuff? What do you think? They don't want this straight path. They don't want the, the, the banks and all the, you name it, this whole world economy will collapse around, but they don't know that we have the right thing. Anyway, it's not, the, it's not the topic here, but you understand, they will stop you because they, that's what it is. They will stop the path of Allah and يبغونها. that's what they want. They want it iwaja, they want it crooked. So otherwise, same if you go back in history, you'll find Quraysh did the same thing. You know, you want to take away of our, the rights of what we do with our the, the money, with the riba and the usury, and how to, the rich becomes richer and the poor becomes poor. You know, we don't want that. It doesn't matter to us. Those who actually people are higher, the posh posh, when they drink tea with the pinky up. These are the people, of course, with the... How are you doing? 
Good. So now we're moving on. Inshallah, where Allah subhanahu wa jalla ta'ala says, لَتُبْلُونَ فِي أَمْوَالِكُمْ You will be tested. Indeed, you will be tested in your wealth. وَأَنفُسِكُمْ وَلَسْمُعُنَّ مِنَ الَّذِينَ أُوتُوا الْكِتَابِ أَذَنْ كَثِيرًا You will be tested in yourself. Not just that. You will, they will slap you over certain things. They will freeze certain things. They will, you know, we try to fly? Yeah. Have you heard of Mr. Random? Dude. <laughs> I'm changing my name. <laughs> Apparently, everywhere I go, it's a random check. Right. Sure. So you will be harmed indeed. <laughs> a true story. I was driving, uh, uh, traveling one day. He says, oh, sir. And then he'll go, wow, this, you know, the frequent flyer program is really paying off, man. So I went to this line. And all, all of a sudden, everybody's standing in this line. And I'm all alone in that line. And in the end, he says, sir, in this line, you will have a choice whether to go through the scanner or you be uh, physically checked. I'll go, ha, ah, now I know why I'm this line. There's no VIP treatment, dude. You'll be harmed. So you be patient. I used to actually get uh, upset, but now I get to little bit relaxed chill because they're just doing their job i actually was in uh, another airport uh, the man was like giving some serious check dude i was like certainly concerned about certain things <laughs> so i told him man this you guys give them a really good massage you know what he said he said, you should see what the girls get <laughs> again family show family show so <laughs> Be patient. They will harm you. They will say certain things. They will say, you know what? Hey, man, terrorist. Listen, dude, I'm a tourist. I'm not a terrorist. I'm a tourist, man. So you will hear other. You will hear. So Allah says, Even he was telling Prophet Muhammad, Prophets are missing before. They, 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 they were told lies. They were actually said that you are this. Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, he actually says that you're a magician, you're a liar, you're an imposter, you, all that stuff. Wasn't he harmed? Of course he was. So we can take that. And when we say, an jannah, Again, we know that you think you're going to go to Jannah without you me testing. You know when somebody goes through the difficulties, you know what would they say? He says, inna lillahi wa inna rajul. And even when somebody dies, what do you say? Lillahi ma akhad wa lahum a'ta. Wa kulli shayin indahu bi ajmal fal tasbir wa ahtasab. In that essence, wallahi, it gives us something. It gives us a path of patience in order for us to carry. This is one type of patience. The other one, which is really a sabr inda al bas. It is supposed to be at the time of war. But you know what you're doing? I want you to think of this battleground as between you and shaitan, between you and the people, between you and the, uh, and the disbeliever, between you and kufr, between you and whatever it is. So this is uh, when you're steadfast, when you hold on. And you have to take the, you know, I'm, I hesitate to say something, but you know what I'm talking about. <laughs> uh, patience, that's, that's, your, that's your weapon, man. Your, your weapon, Akhi and Ukhti, is you have to have patience because you'll see later on in this episode, hopefully we will clinch it, there are, has a negative effect if you don't. And of course, Allah subhanahu wa jalla says, Ya ayyuradina ma idha laqut laqeetum laadu fathbutu. Be, be steadfast, be patient, and have to deal with them in wisdom and uh, speak in their language. And again, that's the episode that's coming about da'wah and knowledge, inshallah. And again, um, when Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala talked even to Muhammad alayhi salatu wa salam, min nabiyin qatala. Even when prophets and messages, when they had the company and everybody else, and they were tested even with the river, and they were thirsty, you know, you'll be tested, you'll be te of course, those who take a little urfa, no problems, but you, you dive into your whims and desires, and you fall into the, the abyss of, uh, of that fame and fortune, and everything else, you gotta stay focused, man, oh, Allah, you'll, you'll make it, inshallah. When he said, Inni bi This nahar that, uh, uh, that you will be tested. So this nahar of life is there. It's running in your vein. It's like shaitan runs in your vein. Majra dam, as long as you're alive. Now, as sabr fi majal al ilaqat al insaniya. Dealing with different types of people are really difficult. So you have to have the keys. Which one has a type of character? What uh, kind of human being you're dealing with? Speak in their own language. Again, these details will come a little bit later. But as a category, you have to have vision. So when people say harm to you, you turn around, say good to them. You know what? You smile in their face, even though you want to smack them upside the head. Don't do that. That's bad. You smile in their face, and you know what? You learn. You learn from the mashayikh. Wallahi, I learned from my teachers how to be patient and use wisdom. Satajiduni, inshallah. Uh, uh, you will find me among those who are patient and the asbab let's now talk about something different category in these the reasons that will help you to be patient first of all know that this life is the temporary it's not existing you know what so I, I'm going to sell it out I'm not going to hold on to it it's not, it's not my goal it's a means to a goal so once you know it we already know that we are created in difficulties and hardship 
you are going to be in difficulties, but فَمُلَاقِي You will meet him. So I want to prepare to when I meet Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Ya Rabb, I've done everything I can. And I know a story, it's a beautiful story when the man actually was doing da'wah and he was uh, in the path and he says, after I die, tie me to the horse and tap the horse and let him go. Because when I meet Allah, I want to say, Ya Allah, I've done da'wah for you. Hayyan wa mayyita, live and dead. We're not asking you to do that. It will be freaky. You know, don't, you know. But just to give you the path and, and the da'wah, inshallah. If you go with different difficulties, people have gone difficulties too, inshallah. And the other one, ma'rifatak you're going back to Allah subhanahu wa jalla ta'ala. It says, وَمَا بِكُمْ مِنْ نِعْمَةٍ فَمِنْ اللَّهِ You have to understand in everything that Allah has given us, it's a ni'mah from Allah. So you should always be thankful to Allah subhanahu wa jalla ta'ala. إِنَّ لَوِهِ إِنَّ رَجْعُونَ Know that you're coming back to Allah. Know that you'll be held accountable. Know that we ask questions to prepare the answer for the questions. My dear brothers and sisters in Islam. الْيَقِينَ بِحُسْنِ الْجَزَاءِ Knowing for sure that you will get the reward. And that's what I'm after. That's the, the carrot on that. I want, I'm hungry, man. You know why? Because every time I teach somebody something, I get the reward for it. When you die, the child of Adam is a cut off. The actions of these are cut off, except the three. Sadaqah uh, Jariya, ongoing charity. Beneficial knowledge and righteous child that will make dua for you. Always keep that, inshallah. You better be hungry. You want some more. Inshallah. Everything that we have will perish. But Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala will hold on. Al-Husul bithal al-Faraj, know for sure that things will get better. Then, istain billahi wa la ta'jizanna, because Allah subhanahu inna ma'al usri yusra, inna ma'al usri yusra. If you notice that usr is actually al-usr, meaning alif lam the, it's definite, meaning one difficulty. Yusra with no alif lam, it's indefinite, meaning ease, ease. So with every difficult, every one difficulties, you get two eases, inshallah. I want to finish off with that. استعانة بالله سيك سيك assistance of الله سبحانه وجل في علاه اقتداء بالصابرين look at the people that had you before الإيمان بقدر الله knowing that الله سبحانه وتعالى decreed a matter and the last category I want to finish you with inshallah the things that's gonna make you bad news the afat the hurdles is استعجال don't be in a rush خلق الإنسان من عجل you know we were created in عجل so please don't rush take your time be patient لا تغضب you know when you get angry man that's bad black dot black dot in your history you're gonna have a real hard time in da'wah if you're gonna get angry may Allah help you inshallah لا تيأس never despair of Allah's mercy indeed ولا تهنو يا بني even أيوب عليه السلام but let patience with Yusuf عليه السلام when Yaqub he says لا تيأس من روح الله don't ever despair of Allah's mercy. Istainu billahi wasbiru. Allah subhanahu wa jalla fi ula has given us that. If you look into that, people who are patient, let us just walk in their footsteps, my dear brothers and sisters. Keep the carrot alive. Keep the drive alive. Stay alive in the path of da'wah. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala make us among them. Ameen. Wa akhir da'wah. Alhamdulillahi rabbil alameen. Wa sallam ala alihi wa sahbihi wa tabi'in. Zakum Allah khayyad. Wa sallamu alaykum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.